opening kickoff, Potomac Sean Wright fumbled the ball, but the Panthers recovered on their own 23. Then on Glass's first play of the game, Timmy Dean couldn't find the handle and fumbled the ball out of bounds. Potomac got the game's first break in the second period. Neil Calloway fumbled the ball and the Panthers recovered at the Glass 10. Four plays later, Sal Colangelo kicked a 23-yard field goal, three to nothing Potomac. That seemed to wake up the glass offense. The toppers went on a 12-play, 59-yard drive. B.B. Shavers capped the drive with a one-yard TD run with 29 seconds left in the half. Seven to three, glass at the intermission. We didn't know what to expect. They were sending a lot of people, and we didn't know who was going to block who, but we made a few adjustments. Coaches saw what they were doing, and we picked them up. Three plays into the second half, the glass offense put another score on the board when Neil Calloway threw a 50-yard touchdown pass to Tracy Donegan. At first, we had been doing it all along, but it wasn't working. And then we just tried it again, and it worked. Then on their next possession, Glass had another big play as Callaway found Paul Fitzgerald, and Fitzgerald went 42 yards for the score. The receiver on the left side of the field ran this man off just great and left the whole area open. And Neil got in my hands, and luckily I was able to put a little bit of a move on that, on that man to, to get into the end zone. <laughs> Glass captures the Northwest Region title with a 21-3 win. We came out flat and played well in the sec second quarter, second half. Kids knew they could do it. It's the greatest feeling on the face of the earth right now. And I, I hope we go to state championship and win that, and that's going to be even better. Go, 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 go